Shalom to the nation of Israel. Before we get started, all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukah HaKadosh. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth, to the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle with King David, 144,000 mighty men. Peace, blessings, salutations to the remnant, men, women, children, shalom on, right? So, yeah, this your brother Shapai, man. So, this dude leave a hump, the humble servant. I don't know who this, this clown is, but he goes on a lesson I did a while back. And, and, and I said, WFI says the apostles slash elders can be wrong, but you can't. So, how is that hate? I'm asking a question, and in my lesson, I'm showing what they said about the elders and apostles and how they're wrong. How's that hate? So this 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 clown, humble servant, come on here and go 2 Corinthians 11 and 13. For such are false apostles, deceitful workers, transforming themselves into the apostles of Hamashiach. That's your men. Humble yourself, brother. And as the scriptures say, if you have hate for your brother or sister, you're a murderer and cannot inherit the kingdom, right? Before I read his comment, let's go to his page, right? Now, now, now he's talking about hating and, 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 and all of that, right? Let's go to his page and see what he got up there. Let's see what he got up there. One West exposed the greed of Ariah, blasphemy, and heresy, right? He got that. Let's, I want to go to his playlist. His playlist. Let's go to his playlist. GMS members are a bunch of uh, 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 grapists. That's the first thing you put. Look, look. A um, uh, 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 rapist slash uh, pedophile, PMS cult leader, um, elder apostle Tahar. What the fuck is this then? You come on my page with this bullshit, and then I come on your page, and you you doing all kind of slander. What the fuck are you talking about? What are you talking about? You I ask a question, I do a lesson, I make sense, and I come on your page, and you got this shit? Look. At, uh, fat, look at look at the slander. Fat ass um pedo pedo um a uh, toha is a false prophet, but you talking about me? Man, you 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 niggas gonna die, man. You niggas gonna die, man. Fucking bullshit out of here, man. So look, I go wait. Time out, clown. On your page, you have a video calling a whole GMS camp a cult. And a bunch of grapers? STF you and carry your ass on. Straight hypocrite. Emotional and effeminate shit out of here. These heads got rebuke for going off. How is that hate, you clown? Get the get the get the F on out of here, man. Let's get some scriptures, man. Fucking ridiculous, man. Don't make no damn sense. You come on my page with your sensitive, emotional ass about fucking Wi-Fi and them niggas going off with the breakdown. But on your page, you got all kinds of slander of men in a whole GMS camp. And ain't nobody been charged with no kind of crimes, but you saying that's okay, but I can't question Wi-Fi. Man, if you don't shut your ass up and sit down, fucking bullshit, man. Let me get some scriptures, man. Word. Fucking ridiculous. Piss me off, man. Piss me off. And Salakia, Israel, nigga, piss me off with that, man. Matthew chapter 7, verse 1. This is Yahweh Shai speaking. Judge not that ye be not judged. For with what judgment ye judge, ye shall be judged. And with what measure ye meet, it shall be measured uh, uh, to you again. So going back to your comment. You talking about hating your brother and slandering and all that. What are you doing? What are you doing? 
What are you doing, humble servant? Fucking clown. Stay on my comment board, man. And I want to do the lesson because I'm getting ready to block you just in case the comment delete. I want you to be able to see this lesson, you clown. And why behold this thou the moat that is in thy brother's eye, but consider not the beam that is in thy own eye, or how wilt thou say to thy brother, let me pull out the moat out of thine eye, and behold, a beam is in thy own eye, thou hypocrite. First cast out the beam out of thy own eye, and then shalt thou see clearly to cast out the moat that is in thy brother's eye. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta cut the bullshit out, man. You gotta cut the bullshit out. You come over here talking about, oh, I'm slandering, I hate my brother. And clearly you got hate in your heart for your brother. Fuck are you talking about? Psalms 51 and 9. Yeah, 51 and 9. Hide thy face from my sins and blot out all mine inequities. Create in me a clean heart, a clean heart, O power, and renew a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from thy presence and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Yeah, man, you, you ain't got no new clean heart. How you coming over here telling me, oh, don't check, w, uh, watch, watch how you speak about WFI and not having hate in your heart for your brother. But when, meanwhile, the shit you doing over there talking, the shit you talking. You probably one of them dumb punk ass niggas that got kicked out of GMS and your panties cut in your coochie. Oh, sensitive ass niggas, man. Make me sick, man. Y'all niggas make me sick, man. Come on my comment board, man. Accusing me of shit that you doing. Ain't nobody even thinking about Wi-Fi no more. It ain't no page on my page. I got a bunch of lessons talking about um they qualm, talking about Wi-Fi and this and this and that. Did the rebuke and moved on. You over there, on the other hand, you look like you swinging from GMS nutsacks. Every damn thing you put up is about GMS. Niggas is weak, man. Luke chapter 6 and 42. Thirty-nine. Let's start at thirty-nine. And he spake a parable unto them: Can the blind lead the blind? Shall they not both fall into the ditch? The disciple is not above his master, but every one that is perfect shall shall be as his master. And why beholdest thou the mote that is in thy brother's eye, but perceive not the beam that is in thine own eye? Luke six and forty-one. And why beholdest thou the mote that is in thy brother's eye, but perceiveth not the beam that is in thine own eye? Neither, how either, how canest thou say to thy brother, let me pull out the mote that's in thine eye, when thou thyself beholdest not the beam that is in thine own eye? Thou hypocrite, cast out first the beam out of thine own eye, and then shalt thy see clearly to pull out the mote that is in thy brother's eye. For a good tree bringeth forth corrupt a good for a good tree bringeth not forth corrupt fruit, neither doth a corrupt tree bringeth forth good fruit. Your, your whole page is a corrupt tree, bro. Your whole page is a corrupt tree. We just scrolled through it and seen the titles of the lessons and the shit you talking about on your page. Your whole page is nothing but a corrupt, rotten ass, rancid ass motherfucking tree with rotten, rancid ass fruit hanging from it. And you come over here talking to me about a lesson from damn near, what, March? I mean, um, February sometime? That's the last time I mentioned Wi-Fi and anything. You still over there GMS crazy. Ecclesiasticus, Sirach, chapter 26 and 5. There be three things that, the, that my heart feareth, and for the fourth, I was sore afraid. 
the slander of a city, the slander of a city, the gathering together of an unruly multitude, and a false accusation. All these are worse than death, huh? False accusations all up and down your page. But you come over here to me trying to tell me something? Man, go somewhere, man. Sit your ass down, man. Oh, sit your ass down, man. Proverbs chapter 10 and 17. He is in the way of life that keepeth instruction, but he that refuseth reproof errorth. He that hideth hatred with lying lips, and he that uttereth a slander, and he that uttereth a slander, and he that uttereth a slander is a fool. You are a fool, man. A straight fool according to the scriptures, man. A fool, man. Come over here with that weak shit, man. Get out of here, man. Piss me off, man. Minding my business, man. Exodus chapter 20 and verse 16. Thou shalt not bear false witness against thy neighbor. Thou shalt not bear false witness against thy neighbor. Go to his page again. Let's go to his page again. Let's go to his page again. No subscribers. Let's go to humble servant page again and let's see what he got going on. Let's see what he got going on. Thou shalt not bear false witness against thy neighbor. GMS cult members are a bunch of grapists. Grapist, pedophile, PMS cult leader. F faggot, millstone cult members don't speak, speak uh, something, whatever. I ain't even going to click on the thing. A slander on apostle to Hall. Stop giving double honors to the to the to the pedos. This is what he got on here, man. This is why this is his page. But he talking about me. How are you gonna correct anybody, nigga? How are you gonna correct anybody? How can you correct anybody, nigga? Even going back to the last video he did. Look, look the last video he did. Avengers Radio, One West Exposed, Greed, Aria, Blasphemy, and Heresy. Clown, man. Avengers Radio, damn clowns, man. You a fucking clown, man. You a clown. You a damn clown, man. And going all against the scriptures. More scriptures that, let's bring out some more scriptures you going against, man. Salakia, so yeah, he got me hot with that shit, man. Deuteronomy chapter 5 and verse 20. Neither shalt thou bear false witness against thy neighbor, huh? Deuteronomy is the second book of the law. Yeah, this guy, man. Get a couple more. I'm going to close out, man. Yeah, man. Minding my business. Minding my business, chilling, relaxing, and here this clown come. R red letter, this is Yahweh Shah. 17. Do not ye yet understand that whatsoever entereth in at the mouth goeth into the belly and is cast out into the draw. But those things which proceed out of the mouth come forth from the heart and they defile the man. For out of the heart proceed of evil thoughts, murderers, adulteries, fornication, death, false witness, blasphemies. These are the things which defile a man, but no, but to eat with unwashing hands defileth not a man. Yeah. So you defiled over there, buddy. You defiled. You was a damn, you a damn demon, man. You a damn demon. And respecting a person, you won't come over here and try to call yourself checking me on doing a lesson on on um on WFI. Meanwhile, you got all types of lessons all up and down your page slandering the men of GMS, the apostles and the men of GMS, all of them. Proverbs chapter nineteen verse five: 
a false witness shall not be unpunished. And he that speak of lies shall not escape. Yeah. You not going to escape, brother man. Hey, he that get of wisdom, love of his own soul. He that keep of understanding shall find good. A false witness shall not be unpunished. And he that speak of lies shall perish. So you are over there lying. You are over there speaking false. You are being bearing false witness against the, the men of GMS, the apostles, and all of that. So you are going to perish, bro, according to the scriptures. Fucking clown, man. Sell my comment board, man. I'm getting ready to block you after this lesson anyway. I just wanted to show it. Before I did the lesson, Mark chapter 10, verse 18. And Yahweh Shai said unto him, Why callest thou me good? There is none good but one, that is the most high. Thou knowest the commandments. Do not commit adultery. Do not kill. Do not steal. Do not bear false witness. Do not bear false witness. Do not bear false false witness defraud not honor thy father and thy mother so all over the scriptures you are in error brother you are in error and you not gonna repent because if i'm not mistaken i think i blocked you on my backup page i think you one of them demons that was out there talking about the holy spirit and i might be wrong but if i uh, uh, you know that you you one of them dudes that them um dudes from Mississippi that was out there talking about the Holy Spirit is when you shoot your your jism up inside a woman. And man, you clown you clowns gonna get it, man. So with that one, man, we gonna close out all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukahakwadash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. Which say in 1 Timothy 5 and 17, give double honors to the elders that rule well and labor in the doctrine, roughly paraphrasing. So how can the scripture say that, but you talk about stop giving double honors to the elders and the apostles? Man, shut up, man. Call him Yasharala and the Bob Abow. But rock a thumb, family. Shalom. Let me block this clown before I even post this lesson. Let me block this dummy. Damn dummy. Shalom, Israel.